Yes, Miss, uh, Mix Master Magic. This is Marcia Ball. We're just getting her set up right now. We're going to talk to her. We're going to hear some of her music. And um, we're going to get right in. So, everybody, this is Marcia J. Ball. Because we have to say the J because why? Let's turn your mic up and give you a sound check. I would like to say greetings to everyone out there in Internet Lab. At <laughs> netlime.com and it's a pleasure to be here tonight okay so I have known Marcia for a few years now and uh, Marcia has Mar Marcia is originally from the UK now residing in South Florida everybody she's an international recording artist um, she has several albums out. She's going to tell us about all of this in a, sh in a short while. And really and truly, we are so blessed to have Marcia Ball with us in the NetLive studios. So welcome again, Marcia. Thank you for having me. All right. We're going to get right into it. And in fact, we're going to play one of your tunes from your latest album. And if you remember, I was promoting this album last week. This is Hello World. Play the first tune, Mr. DJ, and then we're going to get straight into it. I just want to let you know that uh, all the net limers are giving you welcome and greetings all the way around. Well, that's such a blessing, and I do feel the love right here in the studio. It's really a lot of love. Thank you so much. The day is coming. Kiss me a little longer, my love. Hold me close to you. Okay, Marcia, we are going to get straight into the questions. And NetLimers, if you have any questions for Marcia, um, just put them in the, in the chat room. So first of all, where did you get your start from um, in singing, Marcia? I got my start from in New York when I um, to live in, live in England. And my mom, she decided to put a band together. But if more it was my siblings, my brother, my two brothers and my sister and me. So it was four of us that started, and it was a, um, there was a show called Wanderama. It was quite a while back. <laughs> what, what, what age was that, Marcia? <laughs> quite a while back. I was about, I was the youngest, I was about six. You were about six, six when you started singing? Yes, because- With a band? A, no, not with the band yet. Oh. But um, the, group, the family, the, yes, and they wanted us to. It was the children portion of the of the show that we were trying to get on, and um, we were trying to get on at the same time with Stephanie Mills. Oh, okay. So you were up, up against some good, some big talent right there. Yes, because she was um, she was in her young younger years when we first saw her on Wonderama. So we made all attempts to get on that show as well and um it didn't it didn't go as according to plan my mom had us in all different sorts of um performing arts you know um from in oh it's, it's countless okay so you came from a musical family basically yes um yes. what were some of your favorite artists growing up well starting um it was um i used to love the early 60s um, girl groups um, stemming from um, the Supremes, 
um, I used to love the Motown groups like Mary Wells and then I went into like Sarah Vaughan I love Dionne Warwick and the list goes on and on but because of my uncles were selectors they used to play music they used to play those kind of music so I got more attracted to those kind of music ah. okay wonderful Mr. DJ played the second track on the Hello World album this is Marcia Ball's latest album, Hello World. Play the second track right now, and we're going to get into some more conversation as we go along. Someone special, special to me, my baby. And every hour, every minute, every day is still so special. I've ever known I never felt the way that I feel when I'm with you And as sure as the sun will rise I'll keep holding on I'll hold on to you I'll hold on to you Sweet moments are the ones that we treasure They're all built around the way I'm loving you a sweet song that plays on every measure Your sweet melody keeps me coming through but you know, at the end of the day, Yes, this is the uh, second song, Someone Special, on the latest album from Marcia J. Ball. We're talking to Marcia J. Ball right now on Let, like, netlime.com on the Lady Song Show. Um, so tell us, Marcia, what were some of the... Um, the artist that you liked as a youngster and the, the, some of the styles of music that you liked? I pretty much am a well-rounded type of artist when I speak of that. is kind of genre of music that I love was um, reggae, of course, but I was more into the lover's rock reggae. Um, more of um, um, the um, old school, they call now, is more like um, a um, rock and roll, mm -hmm. 60s. Um, the type of music was um, uh, the Supremes kind of music, okay. Motown type of sound. That was what I really loved. And my all time favorite um, was the I3s. I love all three of them because I love their style, okay. you know? You know, I, the I3s is not even a band that I'm familiar with. I need to get, I need to get my music on. <laughs> They were, music education on. <laughs> they, were the, they were the backing vocals for Bob Marley. Oh, okay. Yes. Marcia right. Griffiths, Judy Mowat, and Rita Marley. Good, good, good yes. to know. <laughs> now, I know that you have worked with Marcia Griffiths. Yes, yes. Um, tell us a little bit about your experience from when you started working with her up until now. Well, it was, um, it's, it was a phenomenal experience. Um, someone that I have admired for many years and to actually be performing on stage with her was really you know was was priceless um, it was ironic how we met was through a radio personality of WAVS John T and how John T John T know of Marcia Griffiths from from Jamaica and he met up with us as a matter of fact, he heard me at a club that um, was running in South Florida over by um, on 27 and Broward. And there was a band named Surfside that used to play there. And that band used to bring, you know, everyone just come up there and sing open mic. And that is where John T. discovered me. Wow. Okay, mm -hmm. great. So from that point, he, you know, he... It's always take me to different talent search and say, you want to go here, you want to go there? So I said, all right, I'm going to try there. And then for a little bit, that is when I, um, he brought me to meet Miss Marcia Griffiths. Okay. So we know that you've worked with um, many producers and different artists. Um, in addition to Marcia, Griff um, Marcia Griffiths, who else have you worked with? Uh... Wow. Just a few, because I know you, the, 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 long is, the line is very, very long. 
Well, my my great my one of my um, experience that I had was with um, he's now he's not here with us anymore. The Crown Prince of Reggae, Dennis. Okay. Um, I had the honor of doing um, backgrounds on the last album that was produced oh. um, from Mr. Um, oh, geez, his name is. Um, <laughs> I hope he don't help. He don't hurt me. <laughs> But he used to be Bob Marley's um, engineer. Um, and he was the one that got me that, you know, that job to do backgrounds for Dennis Brown's last album. And it was a privilege, you know. So Wonderful, wonderful. All right, we're going to play this track from the beginning so that the, the, the listeners can hear this track again. This is number four on the album, Since You Came Into My Life. And she collaborated with Endal I on this one. There was another track where she was collaborating with Shaggy Wonder also. Cause I love you more than words can say I love you. I want to give you some shout outs, Marcia Vivica, one of, one of our regular um, Netline visitors is here. She's, she's giving you a shout out and a welcome. Carl is saying hi. Mix Master Magic is saying hi, hi and welcome. Music Jam is also saying hi. Everybody's saying hi. Hi. <laughs> Special holiday Cause I love you more Than words can say I love you in A very special way I love you I'm trying to say Don't you ever take Your sweet love away Get back into more conversation with Marcia. Um, we know that you, I know that you have made several albums. Tell NetLime viewers and the folks in the house about your albums from the first one, please. The first album I w was produced by um, Cornerstone Family. That's John, we call him John Screw. Great drummer, really good drummer, and also. He has done a number of hits on um, Green Apple, and uh, it's countless. But he produced that album, the first album called Right On Time. And then came after that was, um, I work with this gentleman named, um, his, his last name is go by Samuels, but they call him the musical genius out of the UK. And that album was called Choices and Changes alongside also, um, who was also co-producer was Althea. She, we call her Tia. <laughs> yes, we, we know Althea very well. <laughs> yes. And then my third album was, uh, it was consists of seven songs. And that was from my brother, from P9MG, is the, um, is the company's name. That was produced by my brother, George. And this new album here called Hello World. Was produced by Rhythmax, um, the, the singer, or uh, the singer that used to be, his name was by, he used to go by the name of Dougie Mack. The writer of this um, album is um, named Dwight. So, and had a lot of great um, musicians on this album, such as Sly Robbie, um, Jason Farmer, 
Yes. From the Code Red Band. From the Code Red Band. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, and had some wonderful background vocals by Shauna Bedazzle. And I've done some my well, my as, as well. And the eye, you know, Shaggy, you know, big up to all. Great. So you've worked with some local artists and local producers and also some worldwide. Tell, yes. us about, tell us about your worldwide work because you're not just, you're just not lo um, located in Florida. Your work is actually picked up and well received overseas. Is that correct? Yes, yes it is. Um, well, I got to give thanks to the Facebook um, because, and MySpace because it was through them I was able to branch out my music even further and realize that it was being heard in Africa. Um, it was in certain parts of Asia. And my biggest, biggest followers are right now in the UK. And I'm heading over there soon. <laughs> okay, excellent. All right, you know, one of our members in the chat room is asking for an a cappella tune from you so <laughs> not 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 just i'm sorry not yet. quite yet but <laughs> we're, we will we're, have it happen we're drinking tea right now <laughs> so we'll, we'll we'll come with that music jam in Very a little much. while yes <laughs> Sounds smooth, right? And I'm a feel nice when you run it through my brain. I'm a feel nice. It's like sunshine ever rain. You make me feel nice. You make me feel nice. When you call me my name. Okay, Marcia. Um, I know that you um perform on stage quite a lot, and you also are in the studio, obviously. Which one do you prefer, if any? You know, I prefer more on stage. Um, inter interacting with the audience is, is my greatest reward. You know, love, I love performing on stage, and it, it just, it, it's just such, it's such a difference. You know, you feel like, it's like almost like an out-of-body experience. Because you're actually watching yourself on stage and you say, wow, am I really doing that? <laughs> now, I have seen Marcia Ball on stage many times and I tell you, it's, it's quite exciting. And, you know, the dancing and everything that goes on, it's, you know, with your, with your background singers and, and everybody, it's just, it's just very, very enjoyable. So if you, if you ever get a chance to see Marcia Ball on stage, do, do, um, do, you know, do come and see her. And, you know, in the UK, I'm well received, but... Where they're more pulling me is more in Birmingham. I'm from Birmingham. Yes, I know. <laughs> yes, I'm from Birmingham. That's why I have to say that <laughs> because they are um, they're pulling me there more, you know. So uh, I had to say that. Are you actually going there when you go over to the UK? I'm going there. Good. Yes. Good. So Good. I, I I was trying to go into London, but I I by popular demand they want me more in Birmingham. So. Okay, um, quick question. Um, who are you listening to right now? Which artist are you, do you have in your MP3 player or, or in your car? Wow, you know, that's, to be honest with you, um, it's not on my MP3 player, but I have a radio station called Sirius XM, and it's more chronics. I really like, because of the, the lyrics, he has some strong, powerful lyrics in his music, and I really, I'm really attracted to that, you know. And the young youth is doing marvelous work, and I, I really like 
what he's doing and I want to continue doing what he's doing. Are there any other young artists that you, you kind of rate right now? Um, Put you on the not, spot off on, not off of the head right now, <laughs> but there are some others, okay. yes. All right, Mr. DJ, play this song one more time, please. Before I was patient, and all my choices were wrong. Now, there is an enemy Number seven on the album, My Man. I'm sorry, that's number six, Our Love. Music Jam, what do you think, what do you think of the album? Talented songstress, big up Marcia. Thank you so much, Richie. I know in my heart he is here to stay They tell you all those lies, oh it hurts me inside Don't you know you're the love of my life, oh baby You're the love of my life, you'll always be is so nice so nice so nice Marcia tell us where you can get hold of your music you can get a hold of my music in the on when you, you know you're overseas you cannot be here in South Florida you can go on iTunes Hi. you got Amazon you got CD baby I'm also on Google music dot com um, there's plenty of them you just have to I usually tell everybody to just 
type in Google in the search engine. But Marcia you have to J put Ball. in the J, right? You have to put in the J. Marcia J Ball, because there's another another Marcia Ball out yes, there. Yes, there's a she's a jazz Grammy nom, Grammy winner, artist named Marcia Ball, and um, that was a lot of conflict because everyone was typing in Marcia Ball, and they said they see this other lady. I did the same thing. And they said, um, no, this is not Marcia. Ball. <laughs> So um, it was a decision by my brother that says, why don't you just use the middle initial? And then it was fast tracks after that. All right, Marcia, do you want to give a, do you want to give a shout out to anybody, your producers, anybody that's, you know, maybe listening? Wow, there's plenty of them. Um, I have the pleasure to work with Hope Tan Lindo, um, um, Danny Breckenridge. Wow, oh my goodness. There's so much on my head. Um, <laughs> I have worked with so many of them. Um, I hope I don't leave anyone out. I don't want to call names. I just say I've worked with them. And it was always a pleasure working with, you know, the amount of producers that I've worked with. And um, it just has been a real great experience on this journey, you know. Okay, wonderful. Boo, nice track, Marcia. She, he's, he's saying nice track. All of the tracks are nice. That is especially nice. I'm going to play my favorite one shortly. <laughs> but Marcia, tell us um, what is next for you? What is next? We, obviously, you have a new album out. You're promoting it. What else is next? You, I think you hinted to it a little while ago. Yeah. Um, the next, I have. I am presently working on a new album, and I'm working with um, a company named ZP Records. Um, as a matter of fact, the engineer who is with that company was the one that engineered that album, this album here, Hello World, named Hugh Palmer. And um, Mr. Palmer is, if everybody knows him, a slew of artists knows him, 
from Freddie to Glenn to Marcia, all of them know him, and he does excellent work. So I am doing an album right now with him, with this new company called ZP Records. So that's a, that's a something to look forward to. T tell us about the UK trip, a little bit more about that. That one is um, coming up in May, real shortly, and I am really looking forward to it because this is totally a new experience for me. I left England at quite a young age, so to go back there, it's, it's going to be such a... Is this your first time new... going back after all this time? Yes, it is. Wow. <laughs> Amazing. I know. Um... What age? <laughs> yeah, we have, we're having questions from the inside of the house I here. I see here. <laughs> what, what, what age did you leave? I was, I was about, I'm going to tell you, I'm going to tell you three years old was when I left. So, um, I know England has changed tremendously. And we have a whole different generation that is there. But you know what? Lover's Rock is Lover's Rock. And no matter how the generation can change, that music will not change. Actually, talking about um, the, the UK, what are the artists that are making noise right now in the UK that you're aware of? Um, I know Bitty McLean, Sandra Cross, um, Carol Thompson, and um, one that I just became good friends with on Facebook. Um, you know, my head is not good. <laughs> And <laughs> I know I've, I'm about to do a show with her, I believe. It's, um, oh gosh, I am totally blank okay. here. Okay, not a problem. I am so sorry. <laughs> but we know her song, though. Yeah. And then, no, not, no, coffee. I'm, I'm her friend as well. But, uh, oh, <laughs> I am so That's bad. all right. We'll get back to that name. Yes, <laughs> all right, Marcia, let's hear a bit more of your music. These precious lives. The future belongs The joy you bring It always brings Like the birds in the trees God, all this you give And I'm thankful for Sunshine and joy I'm thankful for the joy Sunshine and joy The title of the um, the album, Hello World. Tomorrow, the sun ain't gonna shine. Don't be worried, cause I got this. I'm on my grind. You know, to me, your song is like a golden seed. You got to care for it till it grows into a tree. And if you nurture it the way it ought to be. Hey Marcia, tell us about this event that's, uh, that goes on every couple of weeks over at the park. Tell us a little bit more about that. Well, it's, it goes on, it's an event that is put on between um, Jai Yu Production and also I'm part of it. It's every second Sunday at the park, Pavilion 5. And what, what, what we do is bring different sounds 
to that venue. So we don't give you the same sound system every, you know, we, 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 we interchange it, bring different ones because we want to see, we want the crowd to come and hear different sounds playing. So this is what we do every second Sunday of the month. So right. if you're a sound system and you know you can play good, and you want not test out your sound enough, we want to talk about your music, your playing, you got some good sound system. And your speaker is good. <laughs> because I hear some speakers that just go plunk. And they don't sound too hot. And they're my fix. And they have their apprentice there trying to fix, fix. We're not into that. We want to know that you come and you come and you come ready. We, 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 are, we want you British selectors. We want Jamaican selectors. We want... We know what we want. Island. Okay, but we love lovers rock and today's music, but it has to be clean. All right, and that's at the Central Broward Re Regional Park Pavilion, P P P Pavilion 5, and that's on uh, Sunday the 8th. It's a, it's a daytime thing from 12 p.m. until 9 p.m. Yes. Afternoon, nice vibe, afternoon, um, beautiful Florida weather we, we have here. And we have refreshments. So, you know, come and enjoy yourself and have food and something to drink. You know, we're not just going to have you there hungry and... We did dry mouth. And dry mouth <laughs> and not going to work. <laughs> All right, Marcia, we're going to wrap this up. We want to hear the, my favorite album, uh, sorry, my favorite song on the album, which is number three, I believe. <laughs> oh, Mr. DJ, get that right, get that ready. Beautiful flowers. You can see the, uh, you can see the video on... Um, the Facebook page, um, it will be posted on NetLime's Facebook page, which it, it actually already is. It's, it's um, Beautiful Flowers. It's a beautiful song. Hit it, Mr. DJX. that one up.
Flowers, beautiful flowers is my baby track on the Hello World album by Marcia J. Ball. Um, I'm encouraging you all to go Google it. You'll find her on Amazon, Facebook, Reverb Nation. Everywhere you put it in, you will get uh, iTunes, everything, right? Um, do buy, you know, buy some tracks, support local artists. The, the, these artists, they give us good music and... Um, you know, we can, we can take it for free, but l let's just support our, our local artists and go to their concerts when, when they have them, show them support. So, Marcia, we're going to play the last song. Before we do, is there anything else that you'd like to tell netlime.com and, uh, and, our, and our artists here, uh, our, our fans? Well, I would like to say thank you, and it's a great opportunity to have to be here tonight at netlime.com. I've heard so much about this radio station and I am, it's a pleasure to be here. And such a wonderful staff that I am here to, that has, that I'm here to, you know, share even tea with. So I feel happy. I'm really missing the crumpets. <laughs> if you understand the English, we love our tea and short biscuit and all that good stuff that come with it. So I'm going to let him know that the owner, <clears throat> next time I come here, we like to have some butter biscuits next time, please. Some shortbread cookies next time, yeah? That would be very, that would be splendid. <laughs> you, hear, you hear the English accents coming back now. <laughs> All right, Marcia, we just want to give you a huge, huge thank you. You have um, always come through for me whenever I, I have asked you to, to do something. We, this is the second time I'm interviewing Marcia. The, the, the first time was several years ago on a different um, station I produced. But it's good to know that you're still putting out good music. Yes. You're still doing your thing. You're still... Um, entertaining the crowds with, uh, with your beautiful voice and your beautiful energy, most of all. You Thank always you. show love wherever you go. Thank you again for bringing, being here with us at netlime.com. It's been an absolute pleasure, and I'll see you soon. The pleasure is mine. Thank you, Melissa. It's such a pleasure. And the DJ, I can't, I can't, I can't miss DJ Mr. Oaks. X. Mr. X. You could have hear some wicked... Um, we did mixing earlier. That was him. So. <laughs> All right. Here's the last al track on the album. Many are open, so don't be afraid. 